Hey everyone, thanks for tuning into this channel, where I will empower you with evidence-based information to help you take control of your health. Did you know that some popular gut health tips may actually do more harm than good? As a doctoral prepared nurse practitioner with over 20 years of clinical experience, I provide advanced insight into total health and wellness, heart health, and heart surgery. One topic I get asked about all the time is gut health. And let me tell you, there's a lot of confusing information out there. Today, I will debunk five common myths about gut health and share what really works to help you feel your absolute best. Myth one, probiotics alone will fix your gut health. True or false? So, what are probiotics? These are those good bacteria that live in your gut and play a crucial role in digestion, immunity, and overall health. Now, you've probably heard that taking probiotic supplements is the key to a healthy gut, right? Well, it's not quite that simple. While probiotics can be beneficial, they're not a magic solution on their own. Think of it like this. Imagine you're trying to grow a beautiful garden. You wouldn't just sprinkle some seeds on bare soil and expect them to thrive, would you? You'd need to nourish the soil, provide adequate sunlight and water, and create an environment where your plants can flourish. The same goes for your gut. Probiotics are like the seeds, and they need the right environment to survive and do their job. That's where prebiotics come in. Prebiotics are types of dietary fiber that act as food for the probiotics. They provide the nourishment your good bacteria need to multiply and thrive. A 2019 meta-analysis found that probiotics may help with certain digestive conditions, but a diverse diet is crucial for long-term gut health. So, instead of relying solely on probiotic supplements, focus on incorporating both prebiotics and probiotics into your diet. You can find prebiotics in foods like onions, garlic, bananas, asparagus, and oats. And when it comes to probiotics, fermented foods like yogurt, kefir, sauerkraut, kimchi, and kombucha are excellent sources. By including a variety of these foods in your diet, you'll be providing your gut with the tools it needs to maintain a healthy balance of bacteria. Remember, a healthy gut is a diverse gut. So ditch the idea that probiotics alone are the answer and embrace a more holistic approach that includes prebiotic-rich foods as well. Myth two, a cleanser detox is essential for gut health. True or false? Let's talk about cleanses and detoxes. They're everywhere, right? Juice cleanses, detox teas, you name it. And they all promise to rid your body of toxins and reset your gut health. But here's the thing. Your body is actually designed to detoxify itself naturally. You have amazing organs, like your liver, kidneys, and digestive system that work tirelessly to filter out waste products and keep things running smoothly. Cleanses and detoxes often disrupt this natural process and can even do more harm than good. According to the Mayo Clinic, there's no scientific evidence that detoxes or cleanses improve gut health. They can throw off your electrolyte balance, deplete your body of essential nutrients, and mess with your gut bacteria, the opposite of what you want. Instead of resorting to these extreme measures, focus on supporting your body's natural detoxification pathways. How do you do that? It's simpler than you think. First and foremost, drink plenty of water. Water is essential for flushing out toxins and keeping things moving along your digestive tract. Aim for at least eight glasses a day. Next, load up on fiber. Fiber acts like a scrub brush for your gut, helping to sweep away waste and promote regular bowel movements. You can find fiber in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, legumes, and nuts. And finally, eat regular balanced meals. Skipping meals or restricting calories too drastically can disrupt your metabolism and put stress on your digestive system. Remember, a healthy gut is a well-nourished gut. So ditch the cleanses and detoxes and focus on giving your body the nutrients it needs to thrive. Myth three, 
All gut health issues are caused by poor diet. True or false? Now let's tackle this myth head on, that all gut health issues stem from a poor diet. While it's true that the foods we eat play a significant role in shaping our gut microbiome, it's not the only factor at play. Our gut health is influenced by a complex interplay of factors, including genetics, stress levels, sleep quality, medication use, and even our environment. Yes, you heard that right. Everything from the air we breathe to the products we use can impact the delicate balance of bacteria in our gut. So while a healthy diet is crucial for a thriving gut, it's essential to consider these other factors as well. Let's break it down, shall we? Stress, as we all know, can wreak havoc on our bodies, and our gut is no exception. A 2016 study published by Nature showed that stress can alter gut bacteria composition, affecting digestive and mental health. When we're stressed, our bodies release hormones like cortisol, which can disrupt the balance of bacteria in our gut, leading to inflammation and digestive discomfort. Sleep is another critical factor. When we don't get enough shut eye, our gut microbiome suffers. Studies have shown that chronic sleep deprivation can lead to changes in gut bacteria composition, increasing the risk of inflammation, weight gain, and other health issues. And let's not forget about genetics. Our genes play a role in determining the types of bacteria that reside in our gut. Some people are simply predisposed to certain gut conditions due to their genetic makeup. The takeaway here, Gut health is complex. It's not always as simple as you are what you eat. While a healthy diet is crucial, it's essential to consider the bigger picture and address other lifestyle factors that may be impacting your gut health. Myth four, eating fermented foods is enough to support gut health, true or false? Fermented foods, they're having a moment, aren't they? and for good reason. Foods like yogurt, kefir, sauerkraut, kimchi, and kombucha are packed with probiotics, those beneficial bacteria that support gut health. But here's the catch. While incorporating fermented foods into your diet is fantastic, it's not a magic bullet for optimal gut health. Think of your gut like a thriving ecosystem just like a rainforest needs a diverse range of plant and animal life to flourish. Your gut needs a wide variety of beneficial bacteria to function at its best. While fermented foods provide a good dose of probiotics, they often contain a limited number of bacterial strains and relying solely on fermented foods might not provide your gut with the full spectrum of bacteria it needs to thrive. So, what's the solution? Diversity is key. The American Gastroenterological Association suggests that fiber, which is found in fruits, vegetables, and whole grains, is just as important because it feeds different types of gut bacteria. Instead of focusing solely on fermented foods, aim for a balanced diet rich in a variety of fruits, vegetables, whole grains, legumes, nuts, and seeds. These foods provide prebiotics, the fiber that feeds our good gut bacteria, and helps them flourish. By consuming a diverse range of plant-based foods, you're providing your gut with a smorgasbord of nutrients that support a wider variety of beneficial bacteria. Remember, a diverse gut is a resilient gut. So, embrace the power of variety in your diet and don't rely solely on fermented foods for optimal gut health. Myth five, gut health only affects digestion, true or false? Okay, let's debunk this myth once and for all. Gut health is about so much more than just digestion. While it's true that our gut plays a vital role in breaking down food and absorbing nutrients, its influence extends far beyond our digestive tract. A 2020 study found that gut bacteria influence inflammation levels, which can affect heart health. Additionally, the gut-brain axis, 
shows that gut microbiota can impact mental health through hormone production. In fact, our gut is often referred to as our second brain because it houses trillions of bacteria that communicate directly with our brain via the vagus nerve. This intricate communication network, known as the gut-brain axis, influences everything from our mood, sleep, and stress levels to our immune function, metabolism, and even our risk of chronic diseases. Let's dive a little deeper into some of the fascinating ways our gut impacts our overall well-being. Shall we? First up, mental health. Did you know that a significant portion of our serotonin, the happy hormone, is actually produced in our gut? That's right. Our gut bacteria play a crucial role in regulating our mood and imbalances in our gut microbiome have been linked to anxiety, depression, and even more severe mental health conditions. Next, our immune system. A whopping 70 to 80% of our immune cells reside in our gut. Our gut acts as a first line of defense against harmful pathogens, and a healthy gut microbiome helps to keep our immune system strong and resilient. And let's not forget about inflammation. Chronic inflammation is at the root of many chronic diseases, including heart disease, type 2 diabetes, and certain types of cancer. And guess what? Our gut plays a significant role in regulating inflammation throughout our body. So, as you can see, gut health is about so much more than just digestion. It's intricately connected to every aspect of our health and well being. By prioritizing our gut health, we're investing in our overall health and vitality. Wow, we covered a lot of ground today. We tackled five common gut health myths. How did you do with the true or false answers? We learned that probiotics need prebiotics to thrive. While they are beneficial, a balanced diet is crucial, so they should be part of a broader dietary strategy. Cleanses are not necessary. A steady, healthy diet is much more effective. Gut issues aren't always caused by diet. Factors like stress and genetics play a big role, too. Fermented foods aren't a cure-all. Variety in your diet is essential. And gut health affects way more than just digestion. It can impact your mood and even your heart health. By understanding these myths, you're better equipped to take charge of your gut health. Stay tuned for our next video, where we'll explore how your gut health might impact your heart health. Now I want to hear from you. Which myth surprised you the most? Let me know in the comments below. And if you have any gut health questions, drop those in the comments too. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more evidence-based health information. And be sure to hit that notification bell so you don't miss my next video where we'll be exploring the fascinating link between gut health and heart health. Until next time, stay healthy and take care.